So we're going to be forming an obstetric ultrasound scan on a second trimester patient here. Um, the patient position, you want them supine, you want their legs elevated and flexed. The ultrasound probe that you want to use is either a phase array transducer or even better yet, a curvilinear transducer. Today we have a phase array transducer which is completely adequate. Um, the probe indicator here, you want up towards the patient's head if you're doing a sagittal view or towards the patient's right side if you're doing a transverse view. So I usually start the sagittal view. Here. And you're going to go right down where their pubic bone is. Here. And on the screen, the things that you're looking for are one is the fetal presentation, so identification of the fetal head. So here we see the fetal head in the center of the screen. We're going to adjust our depth and decrease the depth to bring that into focus. The other component you want to do for the obstetric ultrasound is looking for fetal motion and we can wait to see if the fetus moves and while you look right there you saw some fetal motion there and you can also identify the fetal heart and the middle of the screen is the fetal heart and when you identify the fetal heart you can actually measure the fetal heart rate using M mode so here we're going to put on M mode and put it across any of the heart chambers, activate the M mode, and you can see on the screen the fetal heart motion. And depending on your ultrasound machine, you can actually calculate the fetal heart rate, which the machine will calculate for you using the preset functions. So here we're going to go from one beat to the second beat. And you can see on the screen that the fetal heart rate is about 150 beats per minute.